as an athlete, uh, um, I don't, I don't, I don't want, <laughs> I was surprised the way you talked about yeah. how, uh, so many of the college football athletes were using cannabis. And mm -hmm. I did play, uh, some division one, not football, uh, but at Penn state. And we had a couple all Americans on the team. Uh, um, and many of the, the users, including at least one all American, I don't want to call it them all out yeah, no uh, we're regular we're regular cannabis users so um do you see it as having performance enhancing aspects for athletes or uh, what are your thoughts on cannabis as a as a as an athlete yeah and that's a great question a great question so i, I i'll put two tiers to it so one tier now that it's more healthier ways to utilize it i do see it being an asset to the athletes if they know how to use it and systemize it, et cetera, right? For their benefit. And then on the other end, from what we know right now, I don't see it having any type of um, backlash like opioids. So maybe that's the route to go. I know I, I, I realized last week I was reading and I see in Israel, um, this is random, Jake, but it's going to make sense. In Israel, when the police pull up or the hospital, when they drive to a incident, they have to give the the oral, sentiment oral, and it kind of relaxes them all. So if the athletes take that same approach, maybe you don't have to smoke it, right? Just a little oral dab or whatever. I think it'll be beneficial and it'll help them for sure. Uh, just allow me to follow up on that. I don't, I'm not sure about the particular Israeli study, but one of the Israeli studies where they used cannabis alongside um, or in ambulances had to deal with uh, post-traumatic uh, issues, whether that be a car accident, sexual assault, acts of war. When the ambulances would come upon the scene, uh, the paramedics would do their assessment and they would administer cannabinoids um, very early on in the trauma-based process. And what the one of the results, and, and we know there's lots of good human studies now on cannabis helping with PTSD. Sure. Um, so we know that it helps. And, and one of the things that it, that the cannabis and the cannabinoids help with in uh, trauma-based PTSD is uh, that part of the problem with PTSD is we get these traumatic memories and we can't get them out of our brain and they affect us in our sleep and, and, it, and it becomes very difficult for us to forget the traumatic memory and the cannabinoids appeal or appear to be helping modify the memory aspects, almost yeah. like forgetting the trauma. I had a, there was a young uh, buddy of mine. He was a football player. I, I played lacrosse. Um, I'm not going to say his name, but uh, um, I believe it was in the Penn State Oklahoma game, which was for the national championship. But maybe it, it wasn't that game. It was a, he was a freshman um, and I think he was playing safety or cornerback, but, but uh, it was a big, big, big football game. And all of a sudden there goes my buddy as a freshman running out onto the field and um, they threw the ball to the receiver that he was covering that receiver caught a touchdown and this kid never got over it uh and the next year he wasn't on the team um i did have the privilege of playing intramural flag football with him he was a quarterback and we we went really far and did really well um but athletes can have traumatic elements in their careers where you get something stuck in your head and like i can't do it or you know big rivalries between different athletes and i can't beat yeah. this guy um sure um so sure. perhaps cannabis can have some effect that way uh, now, but i love that you said that jake i think about at the practice level you compete so much and it creates some type of anxiety for the next day and I think that cannabis can come in at a perfect time to kind of relax that anxiety. Um, I know you, everybody preps for um, Sunday when the NFL, Sunday nights, Sunday nights, Sunday nights. You have so much anxiety Friday and Saturday. It's tough to eat a little bit. I'm going to be honest. And that's where that cannabis can come in too there. I see it so many beneficial ways if as long as you utilize it and talk around it and just educate people around it for sure.